what um, what other gases are there that we know about that are like high likelihood as biosignatures in terms of life? I mean, what are your other favorites? Inter so so we know we got phosphine, but like what uh, what else is a damn good signal to be uh, that you think about that we should be looking for if we look at another atmosphere? Is is there gases that come to mind, or are there all sort of possible biosignatures that we should uh, love equally? There's many. So there's water. We know that's important for life as we know it. There's molecular oxygen on Earth. That's probably the most robust sign of life, particularly combined with small amounts of methane. And it's true that the majority of the oxygen in our atmosphere is a product of life. And so if I was an alien astronomer and I saw Earth's atmosphere, I'm, I would get a Nobel, I think, on, you know. What would you notice? I mean, this is a really... <laughs> <laughs> I would be uh, very excited about this. About the oxygen. About finding 20%, 21% of oxygen atmosphere. That's very unusual. So would that be the most exciting thing to you from an alien perspective about Earth in terms of detect, like analyzing the atmosphere? Like what are the biosignatures of life on Earth, would you say, in terms of the contents of the atmosphere? Is oxygen, high amount of oxygen, pretty damn good sign? I mean, it's not as good as the TV signals we've been sending out. Sure. Those those are slightly more robust uh, yeah. than oxygen. Oxygen on its own has false positives for life, so there's still ways of making it. But it's it's a pretty robust sign of life in the context of our atmosphere with the radiation that the sun produces, our position in relation to the sun, the other components of our atmosphere, the volcanic activity we have, all of that together makes the 20% of oxygen extremely um, robust sign of life. But outside that context, you could still produce um, oxygen without life. Mm. But phosphine, although better in the sense of it is much harder to make, it has lower false positives, still has some. So I'm actually against looking for specific molecules. Mm. Unless we're looking for like CFCs. If we find CFCs, that's definitely aliens. I, I feel confident. Chlorofluorocarbons. And so, you know, if aliens had been watching us, they would have been going, oh no, <laughs> CFCs. I mean, yeah, they're not going to last long. Let's, you know, everyone's writing their thesis on the end of the end of the earth. And then we got together. We stopped using them. I like to think they're really proud of us. Um, you know, they literally no. saw our ozone hole shrinking. They've been sure. watching it and they saw it happen. I think, How to nice. be honest, they're more paying attention to the whole nuclear thing. That's I don't just... think they care. It's not going to bother them. Oh, I mean, no, worried no. about us. Oh, yes. Oh, no, worried about us.